now tuned in to the SD Experience Sports Podcast. Bro, talk about uh, some of your NBA aspirations. Are you still looking forward to going to the NBA? Have you closed that door? What's your mentality on the NBA at this point in your career? Uh, at this point, of course, I was. I would still love the opportunity to get at least one game of NBA. I think all players, there should be a goal to one day at least play in the NBA at least one time because that's something you dream of. If you love the sport, that's something you, you dream of regardless. But I also know at the age I am now, I'm 32 years old, you know, it's a lot harder to get in the NBA. It's, it's not un- it's been uh, done before. It's, it, it's not that it never happens. But it's it's been done, but it's very rare because they they yeah. like the younger guys develop the younger yeah. younger guys. But it has been done before. But I never hang that dream up. I keep that dream until I stop playing basketball. And I think all players should keep that dream. Never give up. Never give up hope because you'll never do it if you give up. So I, at this point, I, I would love to do it. I, I never stop loving uh, trying to do it long as I play, like I said. But I know it's, it's going to be a lot difficult uh, being the age that I am. If you could name anybody in the NBA that your game is similar to, who would it be? Uh, You know what? I'm going to say a big man that I know, shot blocker, rebounder. Uh, but uh, I would say... DeAndre Jordan is a good one when it comes yep. to that aspect. But being an undersized big man. But the uh, only thing about bar, DeAndre one Jordan, through, one through five, he, he can't switch, switch pick, pick and, roll. and roll like he can. He he can't he he can't he can't go he can't off one the pick and roll. Only the aspect of the defend defending yep. and rebounding. But when I want to say just like me, I can see like Draymond right. Green can switch. He can switch. He can he can make things happen, and he's right. undersized. You know, he's undersized. He can play that uh, that that four or five spot, but he's undersized. But I remember just hearing all the time Dennis Rodman yeah. to take it back way back. Someone who's very undersized, switch one through five, can guard you know uh, anybody, and he was a great rebounder and defender. You know, and that's who I really recall me that I see the similarities to. You know. The worm, the great worm. Well, you said Draymond Green, and don't get me started on Draymond Green. Now, when I know, I know <laughs> you're comparing the, the rebounding. The uh, I mean, he's a, I guess he's a mm-hmm. shot blocking threat in a sense. But you, yeah, he, he he's can more switch of a pick defender. and roll. He's like six five, six six. You six eight mm. two forty. So. Yeah. You can go out the one through four, one through five if mm-hmm. necessary. Uh, man, I just want to say that is valuable. So to any NBA team out there, any front office personnel, NBA execs that are listening, any GMs, William Mosley, go check out his YouTube, contact him on his social networking handles, and get at him because the guy can get it done. I didn't see him get it done. I've been doing it for a long time, 10 years. You heard him say 10 years, so he still got some game in him. Bro, I want you to talk about, uh, so if you could go back in time and give your advice to your 12-year-old self, what would it be? What would you tell a young William Mosley who hasn't made it to Serbia yet? What would you tell that kid who's shooting in the parking lot or shooting in the neighborhood, Rick? What would you tell that kid? Uh, I I have to tell myself, make sure whatever you decide to do, make sure you push yourself to be the best at it. You know, take it serious early, early, early. You know, you got to take full advantage of the different opportunities you have and make sure you get your education. Make sure it's, it's a key part of your life for your future, for your future. But keep God first, you know, and uh, make sure you and take care of your family you, when you when you have family make sure you take care of your family and those around you make sure you watch everybody who's around you you want to make sure you have the people that you feel have your your back no matter what in your corner but through it all just make sure you push yourself 
to be the best you can be. Any advice for some young hoopers out there about a backup plan? Because everybody thinks they're going to the league, you know. As soon as we pick up a ball, as soon as we score five points and get our name in the newspaper, we are going to the league. At least that's what our mamas and our uncles and our dads <laughs> tell us. So talk about the importance of having a backup plan. Oh, it's very important. You always want to make sure you have a plan B just just in case plan A don't uh, work out for you. And that goes to show you, uh, that goes back to uh, talking about your education. Make sure you have your education because you can't get too far without an education if you don't have sports behind you. You always want to make sure you have your education. But it's, it's, it's very important because you want to be set yourself up to be financially stable for the rest of your life. So not all the ways the sport work out. Not everybody get chosen. Anything can happen from from you just not getting picked up or an injury that may cause you not to be able to ever play that sport again. So you always want to be prepared. Prepare yourself. Make sure you're prepared to invest in yourself with not just the sports, you know. Find what else you're good at so you can always have that to fall back on. Bro, if anybody watching this show want to find you on social media, where can they find you? Uh, you can find me on Facebook, William Mosley, or you can find me on Instagram at willmo42. And uh, I, I'm I'm there. I'm always posting my 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 career, you know, throughout my career, so to let you keep you guys informed because I do it all, you know, for for my fans. My social media is for y'all, so y'all can see how it's going on with me. Where you molded and played with some of the greats and played against some of the greats and still the best is yet to come. So, bro, I appreciate you being on the show. Ladies and gentlemen, it's William Mosley. Thank you. Until next time, y'all, peace and love.